to install a Mori mods, what you're going to want to do is open up Steam, go to your library and go to Omori, and right click on it and then go to manage and browse local files. So it's going to open this up and what you're going to want to do is just minimize that for now. Or put it to the side and then go to this link in the description. I'll put it in the description. And go to version 1.4 and download this zip file one loader hyphen 1.4.zip i'm just going to install that and it's here now you're going to want to open this file explorer back up so before you do this next thing if you have any save files that you want to back up you're going to want to go to this www folder and right now i do not have any save files because i just freshly installed the Mori to make this tutorial but usually there's going to be a file that says save and then something like file1.rpg and then back up any of the save files so once you've done that you want to go back to this and then this file that we just installed you want to go into it and then there's www and you just drag it from this into the Amori and you want to replace the files and then after that you're going to want to go back to Amori hit play just to check if one loader installed correctly. And it did, you can see up here. If you want to auto update, now I just hit enable. And there's gonna be a mods folder over here. And then to actually install any mods. Oh, it's not one. And then go to browse. You just want to go to the mod that you want. So I'll just choose this. You gotta search for it, you're gonna click on it. And before you download it, make sure that you read this because sometimes mods don't work together. So scroll down. You're gonna wanna choose which version you want. So let's just say I want the most recent version, which is this one. And then what I recommend doing here, instead of installing it onto your desktop and then dragging it in, is gonna go to Program Files x86, and then down to Steam, and then down to Steam Apps, and then Common, and then Omori and then www, and then there's this folder called mods, and then you're just gonna save it there. So it should be installed now. You probably, you don't have to do anything else if it worked. And it says mods in use too. So we can hit a new game if we want. Yeah, so you can tell that the mod is installed now. So that's how you install Amori mods. Um, I'll leave a link to both these websites in the description.